Uh, we can see it uh, looks like uh, four CHP units staying a safe distance back from the uh, suspect. Another day on the job for Southern California police officers. But what looks like a typical pursuit is about to become an international incident. Burglary suspect Eddie Price, with his one-year-old son in the back seat, can think of only one way to lose California's finest. Get out of California. This guy is not slowing down at all. He's, he's doing about 80 or 90 miles an hour. Obviously, he's going to try and crash the Mexican border. With visions of beaches and margaritas, Price races for two hours toward freedom. Police hold back, not wanting to take any action that could hurt the baby. It's a concern that Price doesn't seem to share. Lots of activity here at the Mexican border. Highway Patrol and Border Police are taking up positions. The suspect darts around border traffic, his eye on the finish line. Still along the right shoulder, slowing down. CHP is closing distance. He looks like he's home free, but traffic bogs him down, and Price gets stuck a mere 30 feet from his goal. All of a sudden, the vehicle arrived, and he was right in front of us. Customs agents swarm the car. Officer Alfredo Morales shatters the window. That's when the father does the unthinkable. He jumps in the back seat and puts a knife to his own child's throat. He asked me to back the officers away. I asked him that I will do it, but you know he has to take the knife away from the baby. Morales holsters his weapon. In a terrifying display, Price emerges, a switchblade in one hand, his own son in the other. The baby is calm trusting his father. He's the only one who does. An agent tries to disarm Price with a blast of pepper spray, being careful to avoid hitting the baby. But it only makes Price angrier. He went back in the car, yelling that if we wouldn't comply, he would cut the baby. From his car, he demands to speak to Officer Morales, alone. The expert negotiator calms the father down and agrees to escort Price to the border in exchange for the child. He coaxes the suspect from the car. They've got the suspect out of the car, suspect out of the car again, and it looks like they're going to lead him to the border. As they near the yellow line, Morales knows this is California's last chance to take this criminal themselves. He gives the signal. An officer rushes in with pepper spray. In a flash, Morales has a hold of the child. Price tears away and lunges across the border directly into the hands of 30 Mexican officers. He'll get his vacation all right in a Tijuana prison. The child is okay, and Price, the international fugitive, is now back home in America, in jail.